Black Star. So a lot of niggas talk shit about Kick and it's how it's like a terrible fucking platform and there's so many weird niggas and disgusting niggas on Kick, blah blah blah, right? That's true, right? And I'm not I'm not sponsored by Kick. I'm not sponsored by none of these platforms, right? All these platforms have problems. All these platforms have niggas on them who are weird, but that's any platform. The only reason that Kick is getting like a lot of negative attention right now is because there's so many niggas right now who think they, they can do anything on kick it's a new platform niggas think oh they can do what they want it makes sense right but what you got to realize right kick wall is a twitch competitor and they want to like implement things that are going to beat twitch and they want to have it be more lax and stuff like that to have niggas to have more niggas come over here these niggas are teaching taking an inch and making it into a mile bro like yes you can curse a little bit more on kick you can do you can say a little bit more on kick and stuff like that you can do a little bit more but the niggas who are going on here and talking to underage kids on live who are sending and trading nudes in their little discords from omegle from omegle there's a video i want to react to right where it's two niggas who had a 16 year old girl in their bed and recorded bro for content like are you stupid bro they were like they were like oh i was gonna i'm, I'm not gonna id her she's six she's 18 i believe her are you stupid there's so many niggas on kick right now doing so much dumb ass shit because they believe they can get away with it now here's the thing it's a little bit more lax it's the wild west right now right but nigga law the law still exists they don't want to have a bunch of weird niggas on this platform doing a bunch of weird shit they will ban your ass immediately if they find out you like actually touch kids they'll ban you and rightfully so nigga like that ass like kick youtube twitch all them fucking platforms they'll, they'll ban your ass if you do some crazy ass shit it's a little bit more lax a little tiny percent tiny 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 percent more lax on kick new platform new rules but nigga if you think you can come on here right and and, and stream you, you making a bomb live or some shit like that talking about some hey guys i'm streaming me making a bomb i'm gonna go um bring it to a daycare tomorrow like you can't do that bro you can't do that it doesn't matter where you go online that's illegal activity and the only reason i'm on kick right is because it, it's a little bit more relaxed i can say nigga without getting banned i can curse without getting banned that's all i want bro I want a platform where I can go on and make my jokes and be happy, nigga. Twitch, all them little titty streamers and fucking niggas who who bought their views on there, bro. Like, Kick has been around for tw for 10 years, bro. 10 years. Competition on there is already set in stone. Kai Sinat goes live. Nigga, you have 20 viewers in your little chat. <laughs> They're going, straight, they're going straight to Kai Sanat, nigga. You can't come on here thinking it's free game. Like, I, I, I would ban y'all niggas too. Like, you can't be doing this shit. But I think niggas have to stop looking at what's being promoted, though. Like, the niggas who do the most heinous shit or what's being shown on kick but there's niggas on kick who are actual niggas who trying to stroll trying to stream and make actual content and good content you know what i'm saying we got who, who maybe got banned on fucking twitch for some bullshit niggas who want to migrate to a platform and still stream you know you know what i'm saying like they want a new a place to go because there's there's other there's other places right for example youtube streaming which i'm not gonna lie is ass ass i've streamed on there for a couple times couple uh couple years it's ass Compared to a dedicated streaming platform like Twitch or, or Kick, it's trash. And it makes sense. Nigga, YouTube is made for long form videos, not streaming, nigga. Twitch is literally made for streamers. Only problem with Twitch is that it's too sensitive and is they have they play favorites. A titty streamer could have sex on camera, get banned for a day, but let one nigga complain about the fact that the titty streamers get recognition more over niggas who are actively making real content let him complain bro he'll get banned for life it's happened before nigga you know what i'm saying there's niggas on here who really want to make content that isn't just crazy ass shock value content like they're niggas who are just playing games niggas who are just making art niggas who are editing videos on live niggas who are just having fun with a, with a community bro instead of these random niggas who want to make the community of kick, kick look bad like any platform bro it really isn't the platform itself it's a niggas who decide to come on the platform and like any platform there are niggas good and bad on each each platform bro there's niggas on youtube who are weird there's niggas on kick who are weird for example when it comes to youtube a nigga on youtube named i'm alex just got exposed like a week ago for abusing his girlfriend nigga has two million subs been on youtube for like five six years he's talking about killing his girlfriend they got videos coming out of him abusing his girlfriend and shit yelling at her calling her racist terms and shit and he was one of the good youtubers too like wherever you go there's gonna be good and bad and are we gonna are we, are we gonna fucking delete youtube now because 
I'm Alex, a Beatrice's girlfriend. We're gonna, we're gonna delete YouTube because uh, uh, random tickle my tip Johnson touches kids. I don't think so, but I really implore niggas to try to active, actively look at a kick stream or try to like look through kick and find a good streamer. There's good streamers on here. Every stream on here isn't toxic. Every stream on here does not want to cause serious violence to niggas for some reason. If you focus on the negative, you will only see the negative. But yeah, though, kick isn't that bad. Looks bad because niggas are promoting that bullshit. But if you see and look at the actual platform and scroll down and look at the streamers not everybody is doing some wacky crazy bullshit all right but yeah though give it a chance give it a chance ain't all that ain't all that bad bro black stuff <laughs>